Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here, returning to you very late tonight for this movie review. Hopefully you'll enjoy this movie review for Jake Gyllenhaal's Roadhouse, the 2024 movie I got a chance to check out for myself, see what I was going to think of this movie overall. So I'm going to discuss what I watched for the two hours and three minutes of this film and let you know my thoughts on this film overall. So let's dive into this movie review. Now this is the remake from the Patrick Swayze one. In its own way, it's kind of... Uh, the storyline's kind of the same concept in a way. Like he has to fight... Uh, like defend a roadhouse from these bad people that are trying to take over and destroy the roadhouse. And... Jake Gyllenhaal's character Dalton comes in the story and is defending the roadhouse but there were some big uh, things about this movie that I had a bit of critiques about like for instance the thing in the original where it says be nice he only said that during a fight in this film Jake Gyllenhaal's character and I think J Joan Hall was, his performance was okay, but I don't know, this movie was kind of, eh, it was kind of mid. Um, it's just, this, certain things, certain scenes were fine, but it's the storyline and the plot and just how it, the movie turned out, it kind of was a mid movie. It's just kind of meh. But overall, the I think the action sequences were pretty dope. The fight scenes were pretty dope. But my biggest critique of it is there were some things that were... Could have been better explained for the two hour of runtime. But it kind of flopped in so many... A few many errors areas in the movie. So overall, I just think uh, this remake was kind of mid to okay. So it's just not a great movie, but it's kind of meh. Um, it's just the story. Just There were things that could have been better explained and better utilized with the script that was brought and the final product was kind of cluttery so um if i were to give this movie a score i'm gonna give it a six out of ten it's kind of meh it's not really one of my favorite films this year but at least it had some entertaining moments but i think the patrick swayze version was better in my opinion and this version was kind of mid to okay, but, excuse my yawning, I'm about to go to sleep pretty soon, so that's why I'm yawning so much. Um, I just think this version could have been better utilized with a better script, like well thought out scenes that could have been very well constructed in a good way, with how he says the be nice thing until it's not time to be nice and that was in the original film from Patrick Swayze and I think that was probably the best film this remake was kind of mid it just wasn't a great remake and I just think with Jake Gyllenhaal playing as Patrick Swayze's original character Dalton I don't know and just I didn't feel the passion for this movie I didn't feel there wasn't enough passion and uh not enough enjoyment from this film but it, it had a well thought out story but it just the execution was the thing so 6 out of 10 for Roadhouse the 2024 movie for this remake hopefully you enjoyed this 2024 movie review tonight and thanks for watching